Hey, welcome to my journey into another way in. Will y'all indulge me just a moment? I want to try something. Something I did not realize, <laughs> realize my phone would do, and I don't know if it'll do it while I'm recording. So, excuse the finger. No, it won't do it. Oh, wait a minute. No. <laughs> when I was setting up the um, thing, I was trying to swipe down to make sure I turned my sound off, and it flipped the from face facing me to facing out. I'm like, oh, I wonder if it'll do that while it's recording, but it won't. So, oh well. I thought I had found something cool because if I want to turn it around, I have to turn it off. But anyway, this it is brisk out here. I had to go this morning to get RJ because they're going down to the um, house to work on the garage shed. I don't know whatever you want to call it. And um, so it was Holly's late day at work. So he wasn't going to be able to get here late if he took the car. So I said, I'll just come get you because, you know, David, he won't get on with it. When he gets home from work, makes his breakfast, he's ready. But if y'all remember this past weekend, Joan and Doug were up here. So as far as weighing goes, we ate out three times. We had a sugary boba tea. I had sweet tea both times we were at restaurants. So, it, listen, I was in there. <laughs> I, I, I just sang songs and things come to my mind. If if I told y'all everything that come to my mind, y'all would be scared. I was like, you know that song, should I stay or should I go now? I was there going, did I gain or did I lose now? <laughs> okay, so did I gain or did I lose? <laughs> I gained. <laughs> I'm not happy about it because I have dropped way down in my total loss. And I'm not happy about that. But, I mean, it, it happened. I did it. But I weighed 269.4. The gain was only 1.6. So, I didn't feel too bad about that considering what we did. Now, I didn't eat a lot. I didn't eat my whole meals. But it was still out eating out and um, that puts me down to 107.6 now that I don't like because I was at 130 so I, I don't like that listen I'm to where I couldn't even have my knee surgery think about it I popped back up 19 pounds from where I needed to have my knee surgery so not good. Let me tell you this though. Joan brought me some eggs. Y'all better be jealous because I got some of the famous chicken eggs. And let me tell you, they are good. Oh, they're such pretty color. The yolk is such a, a bright yellow and big. The yolk, it don't matter. Oh, it must be however they tend to feed them or whatnot. Because the different eggs are all big yolks and they're all different chickens so it has to be their husbandry and it was funny because this morning I told her about you know just how big the yolks were and whatnot and I had me a delicious egg wrap and she sent me a picture of the Nisa sausage in her frying pan she said obsessed I said that's so funny because I'm having your chicken and you're having my sausage <laughs> I said, we'll have to bring you a bunch up when we come, because you can freeze that. I want to jump in this coffee. It's cold out here. <laughs> what was I thinking? I was thinking it went down, and I went to get RJ, but all I had to do was walk in and out of the house. And there ain't no breeze beside the house, so I'm sitting here where the breeze is blowing right through the porch, right straight on me. But if you haven't watched our videos from when she was here this weekend, go watch them. We had a good time. We really did. Except for at the um, festival. We didn't either one of us mention in our video, but I'll mention it now. Everybody brought their dogs. Well, there was these two big dogs. And the people, they were right there where people had to walk through. And they were letting them sniff each other and size each other up. Well, then they started horse playing. Joan went through first. It hit her about knocked her down. And I'd be doggone if that 
one didn't slam me in the knee right in my knee and about knock me down when you about knock me down that's some force so we were a little irritated about that but other than that everything was fine nobody else. oh you know what i see over there do y'all know what thrift is not where you go shopping the little purple ground cover flower we always called it thrift growing up well across the road that ditch used to be when i grew up was growing up was covered in thrift that is original that's original ain't nobody replanted that that's an original patch i would love to go over there and dig it up because that was from when my great aunt lived there and golly <laughs> that was many moons ago used to be across the driveway over here on this corner too just the whole corner was full of it it was beautiful I don't know what his real name is but we just always called it three so he might be with something he's gonna talk about but I can't think of how the baby come up he is oh that's a um, it's like a military helicopter I'm sure y'all can hear that probably louder than I can um, how did the baby come up? And of course he wanted to play outside. She's like, no, we're coming to visit. We're not playing outside. Well, he didn't get to go in the, um, see the tractor because Papa was down at, was that the day Papa? No, Papa had errands to run that day. He found him a box crate. We're going to scrape this part of this backyard and the driveway down get some gravels not the whole driveway's worth of gravels we'll do that at some other point we'll go, up here where we walk we're going to scrape it down because what they sold us on when we put it in there we didn't like it was big chunks of concrete and you about break your neck walking on it and he told us oh that'd be the best thing well no we should have gone with what we wanted to so he said he found in the box scrape he thinks so he can do that and then there's some holes down at Holly's house where they dug up some trees he said he can use it for that and I don't know whatever you know a man and his toys <laughs> his toys is bigger than my toys I have a craft room I go to the dog tree but trust me when I tell you his toys are way yonder more expensive than mine <laughs> speak it Speaking of Dollar Tree, these new knees are getting me in trouble. Now that they can get out and walk, they done walked me too much yesterday. A day before, I should say. Day before, what's the day? Thursday? Mm -hmm. Tuesday. They walked me too much. Walked me too much. You'll see my haul. I went in with the list and come out with a buttload of stuff <laughs> I went to BJ's for coffee come out with way too much there but they had um, I had never done it where you scan your own groceries and pay for it well they had a thing spend $70 and get five back well, you know how easy it is to spend $70 at BJ's the coffee was 25 so there you go but it was not hard to spend $70. So I got that five back and I have some coupons for some of the foods. So I didn't do too bad. I don't think I did too bad for what I got. Um, so I worked on three videos yesterday. There'll be a DT and a BJ's haul. I hadn't edited none of them. There'll be a BJ's and a, a, a DT haul. There'll be a Dollar Tree Dinners and my supper last night oh it was good southern smothered chicken oh it was good it was good it was good today i want to work on a short i've had it on my mind but i've been so busy i'm gonna try to get to it today um i don't know what else to talk about oh we're going to get Sebastian, Good Friday, me and RJ, because Holly will be working. 
and then he'll stay till the 8th. I think they'll take him back to the 8th. I, I don't, it's probably Sunday, I'm guessing. Um, maybe. Monday. Maybe Monday. I don't know. But, so we got him for his spring break. So that worked out good. That was over Easter, so he can get his Easter basket on Easter. Because I was going to save it for when he come up and tell him the Easter Bunny come by and left it. But he'll get the he'll get to have it here on Easter, so that makes me happy. Um, okay, what <laughs> what else? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I really don't know nothing to talk about. It seemed like in there I thought, oh, you could talk about that. <coughs> that. I don't forget what that is. Oh, that's what I was going to talk about. Since we kind of skimmed over the weight gain. <laughs> last week, was last week a gain or was last week a loss? I can't remember. I think it might have been a game. I blocked it out. But I'm going to experiment. I'm going to give it my all. Except for Saturday. Because I'm just telling you, Saturday is just no count. I don't care what I'm doing. It's just it's just going to have to be no count. And if it slows me down, it's just going to slow me down. I'm slow as it is already, so what's the big difference? But I'm going to experiment on something. And there's one of you that will know exactly what that is. <coughs> But I don't want nobody to guess because I'm not going to tell you. I'm not going to tell you yes or no. Because I just want to experiment on it. I want to give it 100% except for Saturday. And see if that will help me get back on track the way I need to be. So, wish me success on that. I don't want luck. I, I was just thinking about that as soon as that came out of my mouth. I don't want luck on it. I want success. I want to be successful on it. I don't want it to just be lucky. Uh, oh, you're lucky you did that. No, I want it to be success. My success. My doings. I want it to be me. There you go. Oh my gosh, it's cold out here. Oh, that wind's blowing. <laughs> so I guess while they gone today, I can make all kind of racket in here. I can have my criminal minds on TV because David, he's in here watching. If he's not working on something, he's in there watching TV. And he watches his blah, blah shows. And so I don't have to go to my craft room to watch criminal minds or whatever, which I'll be in my craft room. Anyway. That kind of sucks. Maybe I'll bring my computer in here, my laptop in here. Because when I can be up here doing stuff with the criminal minds on, I'll be relegated to the bed, the craft room, editing videos. Cause like I said, I got three of them. That's a lot. I was busy yesterday. Golly, I was busy. Well, I guess it's going to be a short video because I honest to goodness cannot think of nothing to talk about. I'm wrecking my brain. I'm wrecking my brain. Ooh, was that brakes? I think it was because I hear like a truck um, acceleration. So hold on. I think it's coming down this way. Hang on. Somebody's getting an appliance. Ooh, speaking of appliances, I love my dishwasher. I love that thing. You know what the best feature of it is? Other than it's bigger inside, I can get a whole lot more stuff in it. It's got that little rack on the top you pull out. I can put my straws, my lids, little odds and ends up there that don't get blown around and lost. Oh, I love that thing. Yes, if you need to get a new dishwasher, seriously look for one with that little third rack on the top. To me, it's a game changer. So, 
<laughs> I like it. And I like it because you don't have to shoot up through the middle on the top to take up a lot of space. It just all twirls around. It's got a twirly gig that twirls around. And the bottom has a twirly gig. So I like it. I like it a lot. And it's quiet. It's a GE. It's quiet. Oh my gosh, it's quiet. And you know what I was thinking? I was in there doing some laundry. Now I don't pay our water bill, mm -hmm. but I know it's super high just for the two of us. It's extremely high. And I'm thinking all these years we've had this um, water sensing washing machine where it senses how much water it needs by the weight of the load. And it ain't saved us nothing on the water bill. Hmm. I ain't buying that. As David would say, feed that to somebody that'll eat it. <laughs> That's what he's saying. Oh, this old goat's getting something. He's carrying it all wrapped up over his shoulder. I was going to be gossiping. <laughs> I said I wasn't going to talk about him because he's dead. Rest in peace. I know that sounds terrible, but she ain't dead. I can talk about her. <laughs> I'm going to take, I'm going to spill some tea. <laughs> Ever since that man died, she has gone crazy. She has been getting bushes cut down. She's been getting new furniture. She almost, he wasn't, this is terrible to say cold in the ground, but you know that's a saying. That's what we say down here. Till she done sold his truck. He was not hardly gone, and she had a man up there in the driveway detailing it, and it was gone. She got rid of that thing. She's been having visitors. They never, and when I say never, I'm telling you, never had visitors. Their children hardly came over. And now she gets visitors all the time. Sometimes there's three cars over there. So, I don't know. Sounds like somebody's in a little bit of party town. Ew, if that is a chair, you know what it looked like? Backsplash. That little thin tiled backsplash. Yes, I can see it through the plastic. <laughs> I hope it's a giant planner. Because <laughs> it is a chair. <laughs> Because I don't know what her house was deco decorated like before. But she she had a, a chair put out here on the yard and pushed it right down, just like him, pushed it right down here on the property line so it wouldn't be in front of her house. They didn't like stuff on the in front of their house. They pushed it down here on the property line. I told y'all before I tell y'all this story. I said I wasn't going to talk about it. Okay, I'm not going to talk about him. I'm going to talk about this thing that happened. <laughs> Me and Holly went out to go somewhere, and I was out here on the porch, and him and his son went by the road with a mattress and box spring on the back, and I thought, oh, well, they're hauling it off. Well, me and Holly had to go somewhere, and we forgot something, so we made the, just the circle around the block, and when we did, they had, no, not we didn't. No, that's when we caught him picking in the windows. That's when we circled around. We went on and did what we had to do. And when we come back, that mattress and box spring was laying in our front yard in the ditch on the road. I told Holly, I said, come on. So we got out there in the dark and drug them things up there and put them right there in front of his yard. So when he looked out that window, that door, he would see, okay, we know it was you. Here, you get it back. That's the kind of stuff we lived with. That's the kind, it, it was going to touch his grass. It was going to be looking bad in front of his yard. So everything, bushes. She even got the, the workers who cut the bushes down to put it right down here on the property line. I can't. Truth if I ever told it. Yes, ma'am. That's just the other week. So that wasn't him. That was her. I'm waiting to see if she gets something else. <laughs> Call me. 
what was their name on Bewitch? Gladys Kravitz. <laughs> if my hair was long enough, I'd put it up in some curlers. And I'd come out here and we'd have a Gladys Kravitz moment. <laughs> Well, I've seen her legs walking. Do y'all think I'm awful? <laughs> I am not the only nosy one sitting up here. Some of y'all watching my channel is just as nosy as me. The trick is will you admit it. <laughs> that might be all. Will you admit if you're nosy? If you will, drop it below. Help a sister out. <laughs> I don't sit out here to be nosy, but if I'm out here and things are happening around me, I'm going to pay attention. I'm going to know what's going on in my neighborhood. And if that means looking to see what somebody ordered, so be it. <laughs> and you know what these people up here that moved in? All these houses, three houses they built down here, I didn't see nothing they got. I, I ain't seen nothing they got. <laughs> I didn't see them move in because when they moved in, they're in the back and the other ones are down the road. Can't see. So... I didn't see them. Honestly, I didn't see none of these move in. Mm -mm, I really didn't. I seen the ones up at the end move out. Oh, my neighbors. Excuse me. My neighbors got some, what it looks like. Is it too early for tulips? Because from here, of course, I can't have see. They look like tulips because they're too tall for that. Um, daffodils. Buttercups. We call them buttercups. Listen, I was thinking about flare yesterday. I come walking up through here and there's so many because we ain't mowed our yard yet. David ain't had time. He ain't had time. He can grow up a foot high if he wants to. I don't care. He'll get to it when he gets to it. Of course, they call on us. You can get it up to 18 inches and when we weren't living here, he didn't always have time to get over here and mow the grass because he was working on the house. They called like two or three times. One time I was in the big room working and the man pulled up and I just talked to him out the window. He told me don't worry about it because they were sick of it too. So anyway, but the dandelions, I seen them and I'm like, oh man, Flair could have had a good, good dinner today because there's lots of dandelions. I missed a little. Okay, well, that breeze is hitting me from the other side now. I guess that's all I'm talking about. So I guess this is a short video. <laughs> I'm only groaning about the man I said I wasn't going to, but he just came out. <laughs> I ain't got Uncle Eddie over there to talk about no more. <laughs> I gotta find my material where I can. <laughs> Okay, I guess we'll have live tomorrow. I'm guessing. Listen, I just don't feel like it. I hope y'all understand that if I just don't feel like it, I just don't feel like it. So, I'm going to go in here and edit some videos. And I don't even know which ones will go up which day. I just know I got them. So, alright. Well, that's it. Wish me good success on my experiment. And I'll let you know next Thursday how it goes. So, all I know is... See you when I see you. That's what RJ said today when they were leaving. He said, see you when I see you. I said, ah. So that's what I say. He said, I know. <laughs> so he must watch some of his mama's videos. But anyway, all right. Talk to you later.